Hi! In today's video, I'm going to show you how to create digital scrapbooks in Google Slides. Google Slides can be a creative and user-friendly platform for creating digital scrapbooks. Whether you are commemorating a special event, preserving memories, or showcasing a collection, Google Slides offers the tools to design a personalized scrapbook with ease. So, follow this step-by-step -step guide to start your digital scrapbook project. First, create a new slide deck. Open your Google Slide. And then start on your presentation by clicking on the blank and then name your scrapbook. To do this, just click on the text and title presentation at the top left and give your scrapbook a meaningful name, such as Family Vacation 2024 or Year in Review. Then click on Theme. Select a theme that matches the style of your scrapbook. You can change the theme by clicking on the theme in the toolbar. Choose something simple as a base knowing you will customize it later. Then, create a title slide. Design the first slide as your cover page. Include the title of your scrapbook, a date, or a special message. Add images and graphics by inserting image to add a relevant photo or graphic that sets the tone for the scrapbook. You can do this by clicking on the insert and then image. You can also use shapes and lines to create a border or frame around your cover image. Now, to customize fonts and colors, change the font style and color to match the theme of your scrapbook. You can do this by highlighting the text and using the toolbar options to select different fonts and colors. Now, we have the design layouts for each page. For each new slide, decide on a layout that fits the content. You can use the preset layouts or create your own by inserting text boxes, images, and shapes. Now, again to add images, you have to insert images or photos that you want to include in your scrapbook by positioning them on the page and considering adding frames or borders using shapes to enhance their appearance. Then, add text boxes to write captions, dates, or stories related to the images. Use the consistent font style throughout the scrapbook for a cohesive look. Then, decorating elements, add shapes, lines, icons, or even digital stickers to give your page a scrapbook feel. You can insert these elements using insert, shape, or insert or image options. You can also use transitions between slides to add the dynamic touch to your scrapbook. To do this, just click on Slide, Transition to select and customize transitions. Then, you can export and share your scrapbook by downloading it as a PDF. To share your scrapbook, click on File and then Download and then choose PDF Document. This format preserves the layout and design, making it easy to print or share digitally. Also, you can publish it to the web by clicking on File again, Publish to the web and choose the settings that work best for your project. Share the link with family and friends or also you can embed in a website or a blog. That's it! Hope you learned something from this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and hit the notification bell if you want to see more of this. See you again next time.